So um, we are right now at the top of this place called Santa Teresa, which used to be an area where the very wealthy lived. And then they moved out and a lot of hipsters came in and made it their own. They um, livened it up and there are beautiful murals around here. We're going to be eating lunch here. Yeah. And, and right now we have a beautiful view of this mm -hmm. favela. And uh, so what you can also favela? see... Yeah, so where it's, it's like the slums, but we don't mm -hmm. like to call it slums. a slum because it has its own specific mm -hmm. um, meaning. Yeah, and the more you go up, the less the, the quality of the, the houses. housing. Uh -huh. But they're mostly very solid and they have uh, everything like fridge, stove. Uh, electricity, water. Right, wow, well, that's right. good. So it's not like Indian slum. But you were saying that there's a lot of favelas in Santa Teresa. A lot of favelas, like, oh. and twenty percent of Rio population live in favelas. Uh. And so the the favelas. So where do they get the water? Who provides? How does the, the water come to them? They have like, uh, it's just like anywhere else. They have the 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 so, blue, the blue. Um, just because I know the camera is on. No, I no, start, I <laughs> uh, yeah, I know. Right? I'm not pointing at you. I know, but yeah. you know, <laughs> this is the 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 level of uh, <laughs> I'm scared. Of I know. Yeah. So so it's just like the blue cisterns. These water tanks. Yeah. So they have water yes. tanks. You see the the blue water. The yeah, tanks. the tanks. Yeah. I see. Mm -hmm. So this the 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 public they give it to them. Okay. And they don't pay for electricity. Oh wow, neat. Yeah, so that's awesome. nice. Mostly middle, middle class, intellectuals, artists. Uh, this is a nice area. Oh, look at this, this graffiti. This is great. Look at this Marconi. Oh, oh. Lower middle class. Mm -hmm. That is so nice. There are some rich too. I would bet, yeah. you know, these are the places that get scooped up by rich people. Yeah. Look at that. And they make everything so expensive for everybody else. So Marcelo is taking us to our lunch place here in Santa Teresa. And he said it's, there's like really a nice view while we eat, right? Yeah. Local. Well, Santa Teresa is up on a hill. <laughs> so it's all hills. It's all hills. Like, oh, like more than San Francisco. And then if you look at this cobblestone road. And then that house, look at that. <sighs> yeah. So we're going to be eating our lunch here at Territorio Aprazivel. Yeah. Oh, sorry. <laughs> oh, and look at that view. So we're on an elevator. Ah, oh. a glass. It's interesting that you know we drove all the way up here just to be on elevator to get down. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> you put one to get up. <laughs> right. That's so true. From the base. After you. Oh wow. Oh nice. Nice mm -hmm. Agora. This 
Yeah. Really nice. Okay, watch out, Martin. I will. Boa tarde. Bro, obrigado. <laughs> Paulino, obrigado. This is a premium one. Oh my god. Yeah, you get the best of you. This one. You can stay there. So you're going to take pictures, right? Uh, you take pictures. I said, no, it's fine. Okay, well, I'll, if you insist. How do people find this place? Yeah, kind of. Like tourists. Labyrinths. Wow. I think I'm gonna. Um, yeah. I just probably much. have Coke and just uh, yeah. What I other juice? No. Oh, Coke. What kind of juice do they have? Do they have a special juice? Tem suco natural de quê? Maracujá, abacaxi, melancia, manga, morango. Manga? Oh. Oh. Uh, 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 watermelon. Yeah. I love passion fruit. Passion yeah. Fruit. Uh, Tem cupuaçu? Tem. Oh, they have cupuaçu. Cupuaçu. This place is so what, what do you recommend? Like any any of the, uh, uh, the plates are good. See, I already had makiki already. You already yeah. Don't Should I try it again? No. And Adam just ordered the gay juice. <laughs> According to Marcelo, what do you call it? I won't say that in the video. No. <laughs> What's the fried pastry? That's it. <laughs> That's it. Cheese bread, you know, no one said it's the my creation. Yes, there you go. <laughs> so this cheese bread with sausage, so that's just bread and they put sausage on it? Uh huh. Yeah, they put sausage in the but, bread. But like the fried pastry, that has a sausage in it. I think that's what I... This the fried, fried pastry. pastry. Fried pastry is the pastel. That's what one. Yeah. You, oh, no. The is coconut, it fried, right? Just, no, just a taste of coconut. Like no, that. but is it like, um, the, is the fish fried or grilled? or? It's grilled. Grilled. Yeah. Mm. Roasted plantain. The rice is just like this. Oh, I love the coconut rice. Of yes. coconut, yeah. They are looking for a place to make the wedding. No. Oh, no, I had the passion fruit, remember? Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. okay. E aí, já vai pedir. Tá. É, o pastel vem quanto? Vem 8 unidades, 4 queijos e 4 unidades. 4 pieces. Comes 8. Comes 8. And it's a small one. Yeah. So 4 and 4. Yeah. And uh -huh. aí, com uh -huh. you're gonna be the, the, the pork. The né? pork, yeah. O coco e dois peixes de cão. Dois peixes de cão. E o ravioli pode fazer com a comandante. Yeah. Alright. Depois que eu terminar um peito de lá. Obrigado. Não, because they. <laughs> ah, eu não lembro de você também. <laughs> Cortou o cabelo. <laughs> tá na. Quis ficar diferente aí. Como é que eu falo? Olha, tem a sobrancelha. Because <laughs> he cut the hair and also the eyebrows. Eyebrows, yeah. Oh, they do that. Kids. Yeah. Is that sugar? Oh, is that sugar? sugar? This needs sugar. This needs sugar. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Put it back. <laughs> Not give it. So what do you call this apple? It's called pastéis, right? Yeah. The pastéis. So it's um kind of like um a fried pastry that is stuffed. One is stuffed with um sausage. The other is stuffed with cheese. All right. Dig in. I'll try mine. Mm. I like the sausage. Mm. Delicious. Yay! Okay, get ready. How do we eat this? Okay, so it's like a, the heart of a palm. It's heart of the palm tree. Mm -hmm. Wow. I wonder. So this is baked, right? Yes. Could be my first time. Oh, wow. Thank you. 
and a little bit of the sauce. And also the oyster I'm going to try it. Mm. Okay, uh, thank you. Oh, they put that too. I don't have to that it is that no. uh, no. 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 uh, uh, I do no. 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 Yes, it's better that way. Yeah. <laughs> what do you think, Anna? Mm. It's great with and without the sauce. Mm. For salt. So what I'm trying right now is called palmito, or heart of the palm. And this is something that is very unique. To Brazil and uh, so what they do is that they roast it or they bake it and it comes really a nice kind of a fleshy flavor and then they have this basil like sauce that they put over it with salt and it just tops it off very nicely so it's very very interesting texture it's quite nice and what's that green dressing that's for now? It's like a it's pesto? like a it's like a pesto and that's what it tastes like but that's very so. good. It is very so. Yeah. Mm. It's delicious. It's very good. So we're done with this. It's delicious. Oh my god. So according to Marcelo, this is the best part. Yeah. Thank you, Amsterdam. Ooh, oh, look at that. Oh, wow. That looks so beautiful. That looks like a polenta. Coconut uh, rice. All right. I'll take a photo. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This fish is remarkable. So this is called a tropical fish. I'm not sure what kind it is, but it was nicely grilled with spices. And we have the coconut rice here in the middle, which pairs perfectly with this. And then a, a banana that's been roasted. And it's cut in a very nice geometrical form. So I'm going to enjoy this for now. All right. And then there's this ravioli, a gift for the tour guides. Yay, and we get to eat it. <laughs> And this is mine, the port from Gerais. How do you say it? Gerais? Gerais. Gerais. Yeah, but it has potato, not Gerais. I'm just kidding. Yeah. <laughs> I'm Asian. I want rice. That's good. Put it in the Right. Oh, look at that art. I love that. See? I, I love, love that. It. This is my type of place. Yeah. Is it? Power without women with power, there's no democracy. There was a gay one too, but not anymore. The gay one, yeah. The the gay one was here, but they fixed the building. So. Same artist on that bird. Yeah. Yeah. 
I love these bars, yeah. coffee shops. Is that yeah. a coffee shop? This is beautiful. And this building is from 1800. Wow. Look at this, how it's built with the rocks. Oh, yeah. So we're right in the central part of Santa Teresa, a suburb of Rio that has a lot of bohemian feel to it. If you look around, there are um, murals that show memes from the internet that talk about people who have been oppressed. You know, on one side you have the guy with the hat, um, is a migrant worker. The second one, the black lady is a black person, is a gay person. I'll show that later. You know, and um, yeah, so it's just such a colorful sight here. There are many bars and um, uh, coffee shops that I think we should check out. You check know? out. So how old is Santa Teresa? Oh, it says there, 1854. It's especially it developed on, on the 1900s. 1900s. 19 and, and this place used to be the place of the very rich and they moved out and then all of these bohemian loving people you know moved back in and made it what it is so it's a very avant-garde very bohemian you know chill place yeah <laughs> yummy All right, let's go back to Feijoada Completa. Now, what is um, Feijoada Completa? Feijoada Completa. So what is this Feijoada Completa? Did you eat Feijoada? No. Yeah, but did you eat? I don't think so. No. Feijoada is the national plate. Uh, but it's very heavy. It's, it's a stew of beans with pork. Oh. And then they go. Let me see if I see some so you can see because if I describe, we won't do. But everyone says you gotta try feijoada, you gotta try feijoada. So I have like some oranges, the, the green thing that uh, Mark had in his food. Right. Cut off, rice, and, and the stew of beans with pork. Okay. Alejandrino. <laughs> this is beautiful. Oh, it says 14 minutes there. For what the population this time is. Huh? part of Rio, I, I don't think, well, it's not a lot, huh? It yeah. seems like it's a small town, too. So, what other places to walk around yeah, here? So, let's, let's go a little farther. Okay, I'd love to see. And then we'll be, this is kind of the main. And of course, it's a labyrinth, so it's huge. No, she's very Brazilian. Oh yes, I can tell. But you know, but it could be. Yeah, some Filipinos look like that. Like that. But uh, Marcelo, uh -huh. yeah, that's cute. <laughs> I like this one. So, can you tell me more about Santa Teresa? She's dating. This is the only way to date. In the those guys days, would be outside. Uh, but she's not sad. She's happy. <laughs> <laughs> she is happy. Oh my God! Look at this. You're gonna have a lot of great footage mm -hmm. just of this area. Totally. So what we're having right now is a size. It's kind of like a sorbet, right? Yeah. So I'm gonna try it right now. Who's up behind me? Oh. Oh. Very refreshing, not too sweet, cold, mm, soothing. And then you put a nut. I like it. I don't think it needs nuts. I want nuts. nuts. I okay. want nuts. Yeah. Oh, okay. Gotcha. It's full of un antioxidants. There you it's go. supposed to be really good. Mm. Mm. It's good. It's sort of like a muesli, like a cereal. Really good. It's full of antioxidants. Mm. They're good. 
sickness cold. <laughs> mm. Mm. This store called Favela something. Favela Hype. Uh, favela high. It's actually a nice. So it's really nice. They have very colorful shirt designs and uh, dresses and caftans. And they also serve liquor here. Yeah. <laughs> and it's what you, you said something about it's uh, African. Yeah, it's kind of African Brazilian vibe. African Brazilian vibe store. And then look, exactly. they even have this. I love it. Here. <laughs> look at that. They're nice. Emorio. Yeah. What's Emorio? Emojillo, that's a joke Emojillo. because Emojillo is a food in the Comida di Buteco. Yes, yeah. Comida di Buteco. Oh. oh, wow. I love it. Yeah. It's just a wonderful place. That's a very popular So one. we should have come here to one yeah. of these days. I like to, yeah, to explore this part. I mean, I really like it's this so neighborhood. Many options. No, this, yeah. this neighborhood really speaks to me. Yeah. And it doesn't have all the graffiti that you see in Lisbon. Mm -hmm. Graffiti everywhere. Yeah. That's <laughs> art. Flag yeah. Of the Cora. Cora. Yeah. So I'm standing right in front of this wonderful church. It's an Episcopalian church in Santa Teresa, its section in um, Rio. And I wanted to show you the gay flag that they have posted up there. And it has the word coragem, which means courage in Portuguese. So I thought that was a very nice um, tribute, you know, right. that's su very supportive of LGBT rights. Yes. Thank you. Igreja Episcopal Anglicana do Brasil. I love this section. This is the nicest section in Brazil. It is. I mean, this really reminds me of New Orleans. Yeah. This has a New Orleans vibe. Yep. Wow, can you believe that? See the gay flag? Yes. The all-inclusive gray flag. Very yeah. New Orleans. I mean, my God. See the high heel. Yeah, I mean, people have... Wow. In the waiters. I think they're waiting. What time do they open? Six. Six. Oh. I love this. Look at this here. Like Jesus Christ. Look, look. What's it? Wow. Exactly. See, you should have filmed because it, it showed the, the, the authenticity. Wow. All right. Let's get out this way. Obrigado. 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 You're just wonderful people. Portuguese are wonderful people too. I mean, no, they're nice. Yeah. They're very. Uh, they were very no, it's friendly. Because there are so many Brazilians there that suffer so much pressure. That's yeah. a problem. That's a horrible thing. That's the worst thing that man has invented. Is yeah. prejudice. So many I can't read. I know. God. I. Sh I'm getting um. The cavity is just watching. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what is that cavity? Cadius. Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> so, I think I, we just saw Jesus Christ behind me. Oh, and look at this church. Going back to the church again. There you go. I like this section. I think the next time we come back, I want to spend More a lot of time yeah. here. Go to the restaurants and then it's really nice. Yeah. Go to the bar for one thing, and there's a lot of good eating places here. I saw. Yeah. Rosemary. Oh. <laughs> Is it six each? No. All of them. It's 150. Wow. Mm -hmm. mm. 
Yeah. Look at the sunset now. Mm. A drink at a local bar here, and it was wonderful. What can I say? It was just yes. Like, Thank you to our friend Marcelo. Yay! This has been so much fun. Thank you. <laughs> at the famous Celeron Steps or Lapa Steps, and what this was done, this was made actually by a homeless man who. Um, I had nothing else to do but decided to decorate these stairs with tile. He became so popular that people from all over the world started sending him tiles. And so he tiled all the way down this staircase. Mm -hmm. And it's a must-see, you know, to... So we're walking down. We're walking down. And I will show you from down there, the actual loop over there. All right. Wow. Wow. Look at this. Come and show it this other way because you can't see it that way. I'll just look show up. it from down there. Okay. Oh, nice. Look at that. Look at that. Okay, let's go next. Be careful. Oh, look at this style here. Oh, so we're just sitting right now on the stairs and just enjoying, you know, people coming up and down, people from all over the world are trying to come. In fact, we, uh, we met this Moroccan couple that wanted to walk all the way to get to these stairs when we were in Santa Teresa. Yeah. And um, yeah, so it's a very famous must-see place to see in Rio. Yeah. It's interesting because there's, there's one in San Francisco close to our place before in Sunset. Remember? But this one is really like, wow. This is something else. Mm. Yeah. Very famous. I love this restaurant. Oh, Sometimes really? I ask, order delivery I because love, I don't leave cold. No, we we love Indian food. Yeah. Oh my God. This is really good. This is really nice. What is this oje tem? Well, uh, today uh, today we have curry. Oje tem curry. Oh, oje yeah. means oi. Oi. Yeah. Oi tenemos curry. Oi so they call it clarinha? Sai clarinha is the name of the girl. Ah, I see. I don't know. <laughs>
artist was a, a black pregnant lady from the favela. That's why he hung out his face on top of her body. Oh. Uh, <laughs> yeah. It's an art. Nobody robs. So up there is Santa Teresa. Yes. And down here is Lapa. It's Lapa. So we're back in Lapa. So we took the Celeron stairs down to get to Lapa. Yeah. Yay. All right, that's it for our stairs tour. What do you call these stairs again? Celeron stairs. Or a Lapa stairs. A Lapa, Lapa stairs. stairs. All right. See you soon. Now we're in Sinalanja Square, and this is a beautiful ornate place that the royal family tried to make look very European when they were ousted by um, Napoleon. So right here we have the theater, the municipal theater, that is supposed to be the exact replica of what the Paris uh, Opera House looks like, especially inside. It's a bigger concert hall, but uh, the facade is pretty much identical to what they have in Paris. It's awesome, and right here. And right over here, we have City Hall. The Rio de Janeiro City Hall. Yes. It's awesome, and then the public library is on the other side. Yeah. So. Absolutely beautiful. Beautiful. All right. It's really nice, look at that. Theater. Very nice. 